Millennials are different. We heard it from Frank Lentz today. They're looking not for CEOs, they're looking for leaders, right? Mm -hmm. And so why don't you tell us a little bit, Matthew, of some of the things you're doing to attract millennials as part of your workforce? Right. I'm sure a lot of, uh, of uh, NCTC member companies are going through this. Our workforce is in transition in a big way. Um, we're an old, older established company. We've been around for a long time. And quite frankly, a significant number of our employees are starting to age out of the workforce. So as we look to replace them and take the opportunity to modernize skill sets and make sure that we, uh, we uh, have the skills we need to achieve our strategic goals, uh, we, we really find that we're competing in a, in a new way that we haven't had to before, but we're competing for the best talent. Um, and so um, um, we're finding the people that we're interviewing in their 20s and 30s are looking at a variety of factors and determining to come to work for us. Um, things like, you know, what the hometown is like, uh, is, it a, is it a cool place to work from the sense of the neighborhood? Mm -hmm. Is it a cool place to work as far as the office space? You know, what are our policies like? Are our policies employee friendly? Um, and um, those are conversations that um, we weren't having with potential employees 15 or 10 years ago, and, and now we're having in a big way. Well, it's interesting you have the bike share thing, but that's as much about creating an urban environment where kind of people can be together, it sounds like, as it is anything else. Uh, very much. Rock Hill's a smaller town uh, in the larger Charlotte metropolitan area. The, the story's repeated all over the country. The best and the brightest have choices about where they want to live. In order to uh, attract people to our company, we find that we're really selling the community as well. And so having a vibrant community with the kind of amenities that potential employees want is vital to our ability to get our work done. The trend was to go out beyond the downtown, put your office there, but it seems like it's kind of going back to downtown now. Are you seeing that kind of thing? We're banking on it. We've never really moved our headquarters out of downtown Rock Hill, a traditional small southern town, um, and we're really looking at ways that we can um, use that as a, uh, again, as a tool in our tool belt to attract good talent. And do you see people wanting to live near where they work, uh, live you know in that area? Absolutely, it's you, you know it's authentic, right? I, I think one of the things that you hear about when you talk to about millennials and and, and sort of their quality of life is they want authenticity, um, and so we're not talking about sort of a manufactured uh, small town environment. We, it's it's a town. small town that's been there for a hundred years, you know, and so that authenticity really resonates. And you guys are in a lucky spot to be near Charlotte too, so you have an airport and everything else there. Right, so. right, right. We work we work all that as hard as we can. Yeah. Well, Matthew, I appreciate your time. You bet. Thank you. Mm -hmm.